Hello, welcome back. Welcome back to C programming. Uh, in this video, we are going to see a two dimensional array that is a array of strings. A string value can be stored only in an array and if you want to store many strings then of course we have to go for two dimensional arrays. So in this video we are going to see how to declare two dimensional arrays and how to store values in it and how to access it means how to print it out. Okay. Let us see this program. See here in this program as usual we have the standard input output header file and the console input output file stdio.h is for uh, supporting print of scan of and all and conio.h is for supporting clrcr and get ch functions see here in the main method uh, that is the entry point into the c program and here in this function uh, we have a variable uh, arr the name of the variable is arr and its type is character type and here we have 3 and 12 in two square brackets within two square bracket that means this is a two dimensional array there will be three 12 characters three set of 12 character sets that means we will be having ARR0, ARR1, ARR2. We will be having three separate sets and in each set there will be 12 characters or we are having three strings and each strings, each of these strings can have up to 12 characters. In the very first set of string we are going to assign text macro and in the second one we are going to save dps and in the third one i am going to save indonesia so we have we are having three strings textmarko dps and indonesia so in the first location arr0 we will be having textmarko in the second position we will be having dps and the third one it will be indonesia by default the very first location will be arr0 that will be te representing text macro sorry the uh, text macro x it is text macro and arr1 and that will be second one dps delhi public schools and third one will be arr2 that will be indonesia and we are using a method a function to clear the screen that is CLRCR and C in the printf we are going to just print it out these values we are using percentage s so that we are going to print it in uh, string mode so this is the formatting specifier for string ARR0 represents the very first set of string that is text macro and ARR1 represents the second one that is DPS and ARR2 represents the last one or the third one that is Indonesia. It will be printed. Let us see how the program is going to work. Let me run this program. Array of string is text macro DPS Indonesia uh, text macro DPS Indonesia. So this program, in this program we have seen how to have a two dimensional array in C language. This is one dimension and this is two dimension and you can have these values text macro DPS Indonesia. So totally we, we can store in this array uh, variables, we can store up to 3 into 12. 36 characters totally we can store 36 characters that is 3 into 12 so we have used only a few out of the 36 ones which are which are all required so there will be only a single variable in the name but it will be an array of variables so that 
there can be many character values up to 36 values or there will be three string values the first value is Texmaco, second one is APS and the third one is Indonesia so if you run the program we will get all the strings getting printed because we have used a printf and we have supplied the values of ARR0, ARR1 and ARR2 by default in string arrays in arrays in the C language 0 will be the first position in an array try this program hope you have enjoyed this video this program is very simple and you please try this program by yourself and in case of if you have any doubts with this program or anything else in the C programming language please feel free to contact me and this is my email id it underscore teacher one at yahoo.com thank you for watching this video hope you have enjoyed this video have a nice day bye